welcome to yet another amazing service of Mavuno Kids. I am Hypesess, and of course, on the music is Aki the DJ. And I bet right now you have learned so, so much about missions and going out and just teaching everybody outside there about Jesus Christ. And right about now, I want you to invite you to just stand up, open up your windows, just get some fresh air as we are starting to celebrate and dance for Jesus Christ. Are you ready? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, 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 hands up, everybody, listen. Hands up now, one, two, three, clap. Come on. Hey. You say it. One more time. Come on. Clap those hands. Clap those hands. Let me hear you say. We have come to worship you only. King of kings. Say. Lion of Judah. Again. Come on. Hey. One, two, three, this is it. Come on. Wakuwa Budu. Simba wa Yuda. Again, let's go. Sokwa Budu. Hey. Simba We enter. Enter your courts today. Bring it. Bring in our offering. This way. Again, one more time, one more time. Let me see you go. Listen, bring in our offering as you lift our hands. Let's go. Come on, are you ready? Every boys and girls, let's go. Nobody, no man can say no. And Jesus has said, yes, let's go out. Yes, let's go and preach the gospel. And nobody can say no. Because you know what? He knows your name. He knows everything about you. He knows that he has given you the strength, the confidence, the psych, and everything. So join us and sing this song that, oh God, how you know my name. 
Lift your hands as you surrender and sing. He formed my heart. Yes, God. Before even time began, my life was in his hands. Even before the time began, your life has been in his hands. Say. He knows my name. He knows everything about you. He knows my every thought. He sees his tears that fall. And he is me. Yes, God. That's our God. He knows your name. Everything about you. He hears your cry. He sees your cry. One more time, lift up your hands and sing from side. Yes, God. Even time began. My life and your life. Come on, one more time. Let me hear you start sing with confidence and say. He knows my name. He knows your every thought. He knows my every thought. He sees each tear that falls. He sees each tear and he hears you when you cry. And, hears me when I and Father, we thank you because you know our thoughts. We thank you because. You see every tear that falls and that you hear all the cry that we have. And Lord, we have the assurance in you that you know our name. You know that boy's name, you know that girl's name. That even as they go out to step out in your name, that nothing will happen to them because you know them personally, oh God. So may you bless every kid, every child today, oh God. That may your power rest in them. May the Holy Spirit continue being with them as they go out, O oh Lord. We pray this, trusting and believing in the name of Jesus Christ and God's children. Said, Amen, Amen, and Amen. Woo! to Mahuna Kids. How was your week? Mine was really awesome. Hi Ethan. How are you doing? Hey Teacher Nasi. I'm, I'm doing great and very excited to be here. Wow. Hey my friends, I'm happy to see you all too. Awesome. So friends, we are continuing with a very exciting series for this month, Mission Possible. Have you been practicing the lessons you've been learning so far? I hope you have. Um, well, teacher Marcy, yes, I have uh, I've tried to put in, into practice this week, uh, you know, um, the lessons, and but right now I'm uh, facing my own impossible mission. <laughs> yeah. Mission impossible. What do you mean, Ethan? Let me explain. Okay. You know, Miss Debbie uh -huh. asked me to prepare a story to tell the whole class on Wednesday morning. Okay. Well, I don't have any good story to tell. Oh, man. It's mission impossible. Oh, Ethan, I see what you mean. But I don't think you should call it mission impossible just yet. You just haven't had time to think about what you story you want to share. But I believe you have a story to tell. You think so, Teacher Nancy? I think so. Well, I only know boring stories like the one for Karoo and mm -hmm. Hyena. Nobody wants to hear that anymore. Well, Kalulu and Hyena sure have been repeated over and over, but not to worry. For now, though, let's carry on with the lesson for today. Now, do you remember about a man named Saul from the Bible? Oh, yeah, teacher. Mm -hmm. uh, he's a hard character to forget. Yes. He used to get the followers of Jesus arrested and beaten. Well, you are very right, Ethan. But as it happened, he met Jesus who converted him. And so he went on to tell everyone he met about Jesus. Now, kids, 
Let's open our Bibles and read Acts chapter 28, verse 23. Here we find Paul telling many people about God. It says, They arranged to meet Paul on a certain day and came in even larger numbers to the place where he was staying. He witnessed to them from morning till evening, explaining about the kingdom of God. And from the law of Moses and from the prophets, he tried to persuade them about Jesus. Oh, wow. Yeah. It's amazing to hear that Paul would talk about Jesus from morning till evening. Yes, yes. Yeah, that's a lot of talking. Yes, Ethan. Paul believed with all his heart. And so when he started teaching, he did so with a lot of passion. By doing so, many people believed him and turned to Jesus. They started believing in Jesus as well. Mm -hmm. Sister Mercy? Yes, yes. My mission just got possible. Okay. I knew which story to tell my class on Wednesday. Well, that was very fast, Ethan. Thank I'm you. I'm very proud of you. So what will you tell them? Um, I will tell my friends about Jesus mm -hmm. and how I got to know him. Mm -hmm. My story is interesting and I'm sure that it will help us desire to know Jesus. Amazing. I'm so proud of you, Ethan. And I'm sure you will do very well. Your God story is one of the best stories to tell anyone. So like Paul, please tell it to your friends. Now kids, as you celebrate with Ethan, let's sing the memory verse song together. Hey kids, welcome to the memory verse of this month. Acts chapter one, verse eight. You receive power and the Holy Spirit come. Let's go. I'm gonna be witnesses go to the end. One more time, one more time. You will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes upon you. You'll be witnesses go. You'll be witnesses to the end. Now, let me hear you say something. Say, select a pull up. Now, another one right now. Memory verse, Acts chapter 1, verse 8. Let's hear it. Come on. Come on. Hey, hey. It says, Come on now, as you dance, let's go. That's you. You will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes upon you. And you'll be witnesses in Jerusalem, Judea and Samaria, and to the ends of the earth. Come on. Hey, hey. Acts chapter 1, verse 8. Let's go. Acts 1. A. Let me see you draw it. Acts 1. A. And go. You will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you. And we'll be witnesses in school. And you will be my witnesses in Jerusalem, Judea, and Samaria. Okay, one more time. You will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you. Oh, we'll be witnesses. Let's go. And you will be my witnesses in Jerusalem, Judea, and Samaria. Okay, let's go. Acts 
chapter 1, verse 8. There we go, kids. Like Ethan, you two have a story to tell. It's one of the best stories ever, and that's about Jesus. This week, please spend some time talking to your friends about Jesus. I'm sure they will enjoy hearing the story. Yes, friends, don't be afraid. Jesus stories always mission possible because God, he gives us the Holy Spirit to enable us to speak boldly. And now I can't wait for Wednesday. Yippee! That's amazing, Ethan. I'm very happy for you. Kids, guess what? Mavuno Kids is open everywhere. You can now join us in church and enjoy this and so much more. Please tell your parents to bring you to church and we'll see you soon. Let's pray together. Dear God, thank you so much for the gift of salvation and thank you for giving us a story to share with everyone, our parents, our teachers, and our friends as well. Please give us the boldness to tell our stories to everyone. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen, amen, amen. Oh, hey, wow. See you again next week as we continue with this well amazing stories. And may God bless you all. I'll miss you, but I'll see you next Sunday. Bye-bye, kids. We shall see you next Sunday. Have a fantastic week ahead. Bye. Bye-bye. What up, everybody? Yeah, we're going to play a game. Yeah. We're going to play free. Are you ready for a game? The free. Okay, the moves are coming right this way. I wanna see you dance, 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 dance. Go. Do your dance, dance, Any dance, 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 dance. Come. Do your favorite dance move. Do your favorite dance move. Now freeze. Freeze. Now when we come back, I want to see you jump. Are you ready? Let's jump. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, in the air, no jump. Let's go. Hello, hello, boys and girls. Welcome to the Mavuno Kids Service. We hope you're doing great. Tedos, yes. How are you? I'm doing well. You look nice. Thank you. Where's you? the energy? You look energy, energy. Awesome. Oh, thank yeah. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. How was your week? It was amazing. It was amazing. Yeah. Yes. Yes. I slept. And I slept and I slept. <laughs> <laughs> All right, boys and girls, welcome. It's week three. Can yes. you imagine, no, imagine in our I series can't. that we are doing, mm -hmm. Mission Possible? So Josh, yes. speaking of missions, did you get to watch the Galactic Space Mission? Mm -hmm. Did you get to see it? Yeah. Hey, 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 you guys, I really, really enjoyed it. I yes. enjoyed seeing the rocket going up yeah. and then the people on on board floating on air you know like this like this yani it was out of this world i can imagine mm. it was mind blowing like literally like out of yeah. this world yeah like yeah <laughs> and guess what like even media houses mm -hmm. they literally had to spend one hour 30 minutes covering that what? story <gasps> That's oh totally mind-blowing. Amazing yeah. that was, yeah, yes. Yeah, that was what, like, yeah. uh, that was a story worth mm. chasing, wasn't it? Yeah, it was, mm -hmm. it was, yeah. Mm -hmm. And then, mm -hmm. <laughs> guess what? What? Another story which is worth sharing. It's uh -huh. the story of Jesus. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. Yes, I'm excited. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Then, speaking of that, uh -huh. Teacher Janet. Yes, yes. Share your story of how you came to receive Jesus as your Lord and Savior. Oh, I can't wait to hear that I story. I love, 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 love. So my story is a classic example of, you know, train up a child in the way that they should go and they'll never yeah. depart from it. So from very, very young, my parents took me to church. They exposed me to gospel music, you know, mm -hmm. the whole shebang. Yeah. And then 
I came to know Christ at that particular yes. point. I remember I went to a VBS and they were preaching about getting to know Christ and I accepted Jesus Christ as my personal savior. Yeah. But yes. you guys, when mm -hmm. I was in high school, I think I deviated a bit. I yeah. deviated a bit. And then yeah, because of hanging out with the wrong crowd of people and yeah. doing bad things. Yeah. So I kinda deviated a bit. But yes. in my first year of high school, mm -hmm. I reconnected. I gave my life to Christ, to Christ again. Yeah. yeah. That was amazing. Yes, yes, Thank yes. you for sharing that story mm -hmm. with us. Yes. Wow, it's really unique. And I am sure uh -huh. there's a boy and girl sharing uh, who have heard you yes. sharing that story and it yes. has inspired yes. them today. Yes. Yeah. Teacher Josh, yes. I have a question for you. Ask you remember the year we went for a short-term mission in Uganda? Yes, I and remember. And then we had the privilege to also teach at MK Kampala. Yes, I remember that. share year. that story. All I'm right. excited to hear it. Yeah, so boys and girls, uh, a number of us from mm -hmm. uh, Mavuno here in Kenya, yes. we came together and we decided let's jump in a bus and we went to Kampala. So like literally Kampala. you jumped in the bus? Not really <laughs> like that. You like we took, a bu we took a bus uh -huh. and yeah, we went to Kampala. Yes. Uh, and we yes. had a privil uh, privilege of visiting different mm -hmm places. Mm -hmm. wow, Among those yes. places we went uh -huh. was a children's home and uh -huh. also there was a place where the mothers, they had their children who had cerebral mm -hmm. palsy mm -hmm. and we had a privilege of sharing the story of Jesus with mm -hmm. them mm -hmm. and even just hearing the story from the children that was amazing. Yeah, yes, but yes. one thing I can't, rem I can't <laughs> forget <laughs> wow, 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 wow we were, we were asked to taste grasshopper. Yeah. Like they were, it was fried and we were told, taste, it's yummy like njugu. <laughs> I was like, no. <laughs> you know, just like just peanut and yeah. grasshopper. No, not no, connected. No, yeah, not Did connected. you try it? No, no, even me. I can't. I, I, I was out. Yeah, I was like, it's a yeah. no for me. It's a no for me. But it was an amazing story. Yes. Yeah. I like mm. that you went around and shared our stories and you connected with kids which was really really amazing yeah so thank you so much for sharing your story and i yeah. hope that kids are impacted by that yeah so that's exactly what you're going to learn today about sharing our stories yeah mm -hmm. yeah so today basically we are going to learn about sharing god story yes yes that's a nice way of putting it yes really really nice way yeah so i've come to appreciate the power of sharing how we met Jesus. Yeah. You get the power of telling our stories and how we met Jesus. Yes. It's very, very important to do so every so often yeah. as it strengthens our faith yeah. and also it, it is one of the tools of evangelism. Absolutely. Stories of how we met mm -hmm. Jesus, uh, it brings glory to God. Yes. Also, it is easier way for yes. people who do, not, uh, who do not know about Jesus uh -huh. just to listen from our personal stories yes before they listened to the Bible yes, stories. Yes, yes, I yeah. see what you mean. And guess what? Yes. The Bible is filled with stories of Jesus followers yeah. who went about preaching the gospel and sharing their salvation stories as well. Yeah. Okay? In the book of Acts, yes. Paul, Peter, and other disciples share their story with us. Uh -huh. And so we're going to read the book of Acts chapter 28, verse 23, where we find Paul witnessing to his people yeah okay come on kids let's read together open your bibles yes. get your bibles get your bibles and let's read so they arranged to meet paul on a certain day and and came in in even larger numbers to the place where he was staying he witnessed to them from morning till evening explaining about the kingdom of god and from the law of moses and from the prophets he tried to persuade them about Jesus. Wow. Yes. Paul had come to love Jesus mm -hmm. so much yes. that he did not mind telling others what Jesus wow. had done yes. from morning to evening. Like, Just imagine, imagine morning what? to evening. Yes. To him, everything else came second. Yes. Jesus yes. was the main story worth what? sharing. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Boys and girls, what is that story that is worth chasing for you? Yeah. As we learn in week, as we learned in week one, God wants everybody in the whole wild world yeah. to come and know Him and to come and have a relationship with Him. Yeah. Now, when you share your story, when you share your God story with other kids, guess what? You become part of the mission to win them over to 
God. God. Yes. Oh yes, mm -hmm. you create a domino effect. Yes. When you share with uh -huh. one child mm -hmm. and they know Jesus mm -hmm. and they share with another child yes. and so and uh, and so on until so many uh, yeah, kids, kids come to know Jesus. Yes, yes. Yeah. I love the domino effect. Yeah. But it's a Josh. Yes. What of the kids who who are shy? and who are afraid to speak in public, mm -hmm. how do they go about sharing the gospel? Ah. Or even their story. How do they go about sharing their own story? That, my, pr my friend, mm -hmm. is a possibility. Mm -hmm. But remember this. Mm -hmm. Mission possible. possible. I didn't hear you. <laughs> Mission <laughs> possible. Yes. So the Holy Spirit has the job of yeah. giving power. Yeah to believers, to speak boldly mm -hmm. about Jesus. Yes. Boys and girls, we hope you will step out and tell somebody about how you met Jesus. You can yeah. tell your friends, you can tell mm -hmm. your neighbors, you can yes. tell everyone. Yeah. And imagine having a domino effect of kids talking about Jesus, spreading, spreading across schools, yes. Easter's and beyond. Wouldn't that be cool? That would be awesome. It, yes. I'm just even imagining in... MK, mm -hmm. Imavuno kids. Yes. Imagine us t sharing God's story to a million children. Yes. And exactly uh, what God wants yes. because He loves all, all people. Yes. This week, tell someone about how you yes. met Jesus. You can even start with your family, yes. uh, family members over dinner, or yes. closest friend at school, yes. or even at home. Mm -hmm. By doing so, you will be part of the great story ever told a story truly worth sharing yes. and chasing yes 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 absolutely boys and girls you have come to the end of our lesson for today join us next sunday as yeah. you continue on this series called mission, mission possible yes, 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 yes. that's right it's mission possible, possible. it is boys yes. and girls it was truly an honor to be with you here till next time let's pray Dear Lord, thank you for today. Thank you for reminding us that even us can share our story so that people can come to know Jesus. We thank you and we bless you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. 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 Thank you so much, Teter Josh. You're welcome. And kids, see you next weekend. Bye-bye. Bye. God bless you. God bless.